This is Kendall Kirk. I'm the Precision Ag Agriculture Engineer with Clemson University. I'm going to show you a quick demonstration of a, a new software application that we have called Polygon Merge Tool. Uh, this is a Windows application, very simple application for merging shapefile polygon data sets. Uh, so I'm going to step through it here. I'll have the link in the description so that you can access this website. Um, right here we see when you when you launch the program this is what you see again this is a, a very simple uh, not a whole lot of bells and whistles of the program it's very utilitarian you simply go to a file a folder uh, from which you wish to merge shape files and you specify one of those shape files any one of them in that folder uh, what the software will do is it will attempt to merge all of the files in that folder or all of the shape files. Uh, if it encounters shape files that are not polygon data sets, it'll skip over those. Uh, again, this is just for merging polygon type shape files. Once you've specified the folder, uh, you need to specify the output file name. This can be whatever you wish to call it. In this case, I'm going to call it uh, pivot merge. So we can see that there's six shape files in this folder. Uh, these were shape files. These are center pivots that, that I created using our center pivot mapper software. Um, once you've specified the output file name, you hit save and it will proceed to process all of the files. Uh, in this box up here, it'll update you on what it did. Shape file merger complete. Six files containing polygons were merged. Six records are contained in the output shape file. So in some cases, if you're merging field boundaries uh, or uh, zones for, for soil sampling, uh, you may have more than one polygon per shape file, and that'll be reflected here. Um, at that point, if you want to do another merge, you can hit reset form and start another merge. What I'd like to do, though, is show you what we have done. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to read in the file that we just created. So here's the individual uh, pivot, center pivot boundary files essentially, and then here's the file that we just created, pivot merge. I double click it. Uh, this is in FarmWorks that I'm using, but any GIS software should be able to read these shape files. When you bring them in, in this case they're on the tree over here, I'll double click pivot merge. And there's the six independent polygon data sets that were once in six separate shape files now merged together in one. We've got the original shape IDs that, you know, this is what the they were saved as, shape ID. They were all stored as a value of one. Uh, and then it does append an object ID. Uh, it's called object ID merge, uh, where it just sequentially counts up by polygon that it finds. That's pretty much it. Again, very simple software application designed to, to make this a quick and simple process for merging boundary files, merging zone sampling, grid sampling files, uh, just to, to make people in, make people's lives a little bit easier in, in the world of precision agriculture. If you have any questions, please let us know using the contact form on our website. Thanks.